start off by saying I know the background of my house is insane but I am moving so there's boxes here, boxes here, my dress form with coats on it and I didn't even make those coats. Um, yeah. So pretty soon you guys are going to see me in a whole new destination anyway. But yeah, let's go. So let's start off by my name. My name is Shakita. I cannot stand my name because people want to sing the banana song. My name is Shakita and I'm here to say something, 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 something. But my name is Shakita. Not that Chakita thing with the fruits and stuff on her head like really I am 22 years old years young years old I'm 22 years old and I look like a 12 year old so I don't care why did I change my YouTube name my YouTube name at first was Kita forever and I had that since I was, I don't know, but I know it was like 2008, 2007 or something like that when I was so into watching girl fights on YouTube. Like, I was a weirdo. I was literally obsessed with girl fights and I had no reason why. And I felt I had to be... I think the content, like, you had to be 18 or something like that. And I just decided, well, let me just sign up so I can watch all the YouTube videos I want to watch. So that's what I did. And I just typed in Kita Forever. And that's how that became my YouTube name. And now I changed it to S. Dot Lee. And, well, my name is Shakita and my middle name is Lee. So... S. Lee. And that's how you say it. I didn't feel like putting S and then spelling out dot and then putting Lee. But how do you say it? It's S. Lee. So, again, I joined YouTube to watch girl fight videos. It's sad. My favorite color is orange. I love orange. Do I love to wear orange? Not really, but my favorite color is orange. I think it's a pretty bright color, and it, I don't know, I think orange, like, really explains my personality, if that makes sense. Like, it's so bright and vibrant. How would I explain my style of fashion? Um, I like to take risks with it sometimes, at times. I like to dress, I don't know, I, I don't I don't know how to explain it, okay? No, I really like to take risks with my clothing and I like originality. I don't like to look like the next person, even though today I'm so plain. I don't like to look like the next person. Originality is key, people. My lucky number. Let's talk about my lucky number that has changed. Oh, my honey. This is my honey. This is my baby. Oh, yeah, my honey. She's so cute. Okay, back to my lucky number. Um, okay. My favorite number was seven, honestly. No lie. That was my lucky number. I used seven for everything. Number seven was my number. Why? Because November 7th is my birthday. Number seven is always a lucky number. And, yeah, seven became my number. Then I went through this whole phase of being obsessed with Kobe Bryant when his jersey number was number eight. And yeah, I traded on seven for eight. And now both of them are like my lucky numbers. What do I do for a living? Um, besides sleep, it's like, no, I get no sleep. I can't sleep for nothing. Um, right now, I am a nursing assistant. I wipe older people butts. No, I am a nursing assistant. And now I'm going to school for, to be a med, uh, a med technician, a med tech. 
a medicine tech. Yes. And then after I finish that, I'm going to school to be patient care tech. So I'm working my way up the healthcare ladder. Yeah. My dream place to go is actually where I want my dream honeymoon to be. Which is Bora Bora. I think Bora Bora is a beautiful place. My favorite season is fall. Da, da, da. The reason why fall is my favorite season is because my birthday is in that season. One. Two, I just love the fall season. I love the little colorful leaves. And my favorite of all time, it's boop season. One thing that I really miss in this life. I really miss the relationship that I had with my ex-boyfriend. He's my ex-boyfriend now, so if that makes sense. Okay, we were best friends like for years before we got together. We got together and now we're not together. So I really do miss the relationship that me and him used to have. Um, I really think that, you know, when you get with someone, you can never fall back to where you guys were beforehand because, like, love just does that. I mean, we stay in contact. We're still really close, but we're just not as close as we used to be. Where do I see myself in five years? I see myself very successful. Um, Successful in my term in my life would be um, two jobs, meaning one, working for the man and people working for me. Ah, so you working for the woman. Mm. Why didn't I do a TMI tag instead of just basic random facts? Because I really think the TI, the TI, I really think that the TMI tag is kind of repetitive. I feel as though everyone's answering the same questions, like, take you to take a shower. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? And, yeah, I mean, they're good. You do want to know about your favorite subscriber, I mean, your favorite YouTuber. So, of course, we're going to watch it because we're interested a little. And, yeah, but TMI tag, I just did my own some random facts for you guys. Boom! Let me tell you guys how many hours I spend on YouTube. Um, way too many. I ain't lying, I ain't lying. What scares me the most? Okay, when I tell you guys this, please don't laugh at me. I'm not scared of spiders. Like, spiders does not bother me whatsoever. If I see a spider, I'll tell someone to kill it. I won't freak out. I won't. I really won't. I'll be like, hey, can you kill this spider? Or I'll take it amongst myself, get some rain, and kill the motherfucker. I'm terrified of ladybugs. There. I said it. I am so scared. Like, I am before the cross right now. I am... Strike me. He could strike me if, if I'm lying. I am terrified of ladybugs. I will freak out i will freak out i will i will scream have a heart attack piss in my pants and everything else i am scared of ladybugs my top three pet peeves i cannot stand it when people don't use their blinker you're in front of me and you don't use your blinker and you're about to make a right turn oh the road rage i if you chew like a freaking cow and like we're at the same table, ugh, pet peeve all the way. And number one, I cannot stand ignorance and people that, you know, think they're better than the other. I am very competitive. I am very competitive. Um, I, I'm not gonna lie to you, I really did chill out, but growing up, I played sports. I was a dancer, I played basketball, I was a cheerleader, all of it, like, I did sports and I was always in competition, like, 
it was always a competition. Either there was championship or a regular game or whatever. I I don't know. I just became very competitive and I go for what I want. And even now when I'm not doing a sport, I am very competitive. And I did chill out. I did. I didn't show my competitive side. But I'm going for the gold and I'm getting what I want because I am competitive all up in that. Hmm. <laughs> what? I see something I want, I'm going for it. Oh, you said that's my future, man? Oh, oh yeah, I'm taking that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's how it is. My favorite food, I have two. I have two, I have two, I have two. I love me some spaghetti. I will eat spaghetti every single day of the year. I love spaghetti. 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 And, yeah. My second favorite is pizza. I really can't go in detail. It's just, mm, mm, good. Juice or soda? Um, I prefer juice. I don't. Soda burns my throat. My Ooh. favorite fruit. Pineapple. How much do my little ass weigh? <laughs> I actually weigh... 122 at the moment. I am trying to get to 135 because that's how much I was before I went through my whole little depression mode. Um, I was very depressed last year and I lost massive, massive weight to the point I went down from 135 to 98 pounds. Why was I gone from YouTube so long? Um, that goes back into my depression I was very depressed um I did make a video when I was in my depression phase I think it was what's in my purse and uh, outfit of the day video I was very depressed but I try not to show it as much and that day I don't know what came over me I just decided hey get up put some makeup on get dressed and make a video and, um, yeah, after that, I just was, I was fed up with life. <laughs> yeah, I was very depressed. Um, my breakup really devastated me. And I couldn't go on. Like, I didn't want to, like, life felt like it had no purpose anymore. So... I was very depressed. I stayed in my bed a lot. I only got up to shower. Um, I wasn't working or anything. Like, I just sat in my bed, laid in my bed, and the only thing that made me happy was Spongebob. No lie. I just couldn't face the world. I couldn't... It was just so much that I could not do because I wouldn't let myself do it, so... That's why I was away from YouTube and I had lost all of this weight and you guys would have just been like, what the fuck? So yeah, what do I do in my spare time? I pretty much sit on YouTube. I sit on YouTube, I go to the mall, I get my nails done. I try to do as much as I can to try to keep myself busy. My favorite sweets would have to be donuts and cupcakes. I cannot stand candy. I can't. Like, I don't, I don't know. I think I was, like, deprived as a child. Like, <laughs> am I back on YouTube for good? Yes, sir. Yes, I am. Yes, I'm back on YouTube for good. For good. I'm not going to disappear again. I'm back for good. So, those were just a few facts about me. Not really much details, but I decided to just go ahead and do a video. It was on my mind, and I didn't want to do a TMI tag. It was the same questions that everyone had, like... Oh, how long does it take you to take a shower? Uh, 10 minutes. Oh, 20 minutes. Oh, oh, okay. And then the next question, oh, it takes me about 10, 20 minutes. So, it's kind of the same questions. I did throw in some of the same questions that was on there, but I gave you guys a little bit more. So... Yeah, see you guys next time. Bye.